I request Mr. Ramnathan to please introduce uh, Professor Vinay Krishnan. Good. We are really grateful to Professor Uni Krishnan for uh, coming all the way from Karaga to Chennai. Um, he is gifted with a wonderful voice and, uh, and probably appropriate that he speaks on voice culture to us. He has been giving talks all over the country and probably abroad also. And uh, it's really, and we have also had a couple of lectures in Chennai earlier, I think once in the Music Academy and once in Parsar the Swami Sabha. And so we are indeed fortunate that he's come over here. Now I, between you and Sri Unni Krishna. And mainly, uh, voice culture as a subject, it's a very vast subject. There are so many branches for uh, elaboration. The foremost thing is voice production as general. Then only we can bifurcate it into so many branches. So the very aspect of voice production it is not only singing. We should know the science behind the voice production foremost thing for a singer also let it be any branch of any discipline they should know the science of voice production they should have the right method of voice production right method of breathing and the techniques to have a flexible voice and the voice to bring under their control. If you achieve these things, then you can divert to any branch of music. And I believe that uh, a singer, a vocalist, in the real sense, must be able to sing all the styles of music. Before learning music, or if you, even if you start learning voice production in the real sense. You must be able to sing all the styles. For that, you have to, your practice session should include all varieties of exercises specially designed to bring the voice under your control. Later on, this flexibility and control will help you to modulate your voice as per the requirement to sing any other variety of music. Normally, singers are having the problems of lack of range. This is one problem I have uh, noticed very much. Either they will not be able to sing in the lower octave or uh, they will be finding it difficult to sing in the higher octave. Another thing is having strain on the voice after, even after singing for half an hour, you feel that the quality you started with is gone. And you feel a kind of uh, peculiar strain on your voice. You start coughing and you, you feel to stop the singing. Unwanted shake on the voice. The voice cannot be sustained for a long time without any shake. That is due to the lack of control on your muscles. There are reasons for all these kind of problems. So that you should know a bit of science behind the voice production. First of all, we should know the vocal tract configuration. Vocal tract configuration is the complete structure of vocal apparatus. Larynx, related muscles, ligaments and pharynx, then your soft palate, your tongue, the shape of your mouth, length of your larynx, 
and the space of your pharyngeal area your position of teeth position of lips these are the vocal tract configuration there are uh, uh, some factors already genetically determined there are factors genetically determined and even though the genetically determined factors some areas we can develop by applying of some techniques the pharyngeal area is an important part there are so many areas not activated in many singers so many areas of vocal apparatus these areas are to be activated by way of applying certain specified and technically designed exercises other than the traditionally uh, prescribed exercises it will have quick result there are three systems phonatory system respiratory system and resonatory system these are the three pillars of voice production